Hi everyone, welcome to the newest episode for the Chang's Chinese Classroom. Today is the first part of lesson four. The topic is why my laptop broke down again. Okay, let's uh, take a look at the first sentence. The first one with me. 这是我的电话号码. 这是我的电话号码. Okay, this should to be. 我, me, and the possess, and all together, 我的, my, or mine, and here refers to my, 电话, that's the phone, general calling for all the phones, and this is our new word with me, 号码, 号码, that's for number, so 电话号码, all together, would be phone number, so this is my phone number, this is my phone number, perfect translation, next one, 会议室的房间号码是多少? 会议室的房间号码是多少? First, 会议室, do you remember? That's nonsense. First, 会议. 会议 would be meeting. And the 室 normally refers to room. So, 会议室 would be meeting room. Right? 会议室 will be meeting room. 会议室 the possess and this one 房间 that's the room, right? That's the room, okay? And difference between 房间 and 会议室 is this one normally goes after the specific function to refer to a specific room, okay? And this 房间 is the general calling for room. So 会议室 the 房间号码 what's the 房间号码 altogether? That would be Room number, okay? That would be room number. 房间号码 would be room number. So the room number of the meeting room is 多少? How many? Okay, pay attention to the translation. Uh, in English, that would be what is the number for the conference room? What is the number or the room number of the conference room or the meeting room? But in Chinese, we use 多少, how many, to ask for numbers. Okay, so pay attention to this one. Here is not 什么, it's 多少. Okay, sentence number two. 这是我的传真号码. 这是我的传真号码. This is my number about, new word, 传真. 传真, okay, so 传真 is the fax number, and normally in natural translation it just refers to fax, so this is my fax number. And the interesting word, this one, 传, means to pass or pass down, and 真 means reality or true, okay, so for us, fax is just the way of pass the truth, to pass the real thing. Next one, 资料传真过来了。资料传真过来了 Okay, remember this one, 资料 from the previous class, that's the data or material, right here, normally it refers to material. The material, 传真, faxed, 过来, come over, 了, past tense here. So the data has already been faxed over, right? The data has already been faxed over. Okay, next one. 我们的传真机坏了. 我们的传真机坏了. Actually, I never used the fax machine in our institute. This one. 我们, us. Okay, so 我们的, that would be our. And this one, 传真, fax. G refers to machine. So, 传真机, need I explain? Fax machine, okay? 坏, broke. 坏 is brick or bad. Here, let me see if I can find this. Broke, no, not in here. Wicked, okay? So, here, 坏 means broke and the la. Past tense, broken. Our fax machine is broken. Next one. 对方公司的资料 
传真过来了。对方公司的资料传真过来了。Okay, first this part first. This one, 资料 material, 传真 facts, 过来了 The data has already been faxed over. What material? That's 公司的 the company, the company's material. Okay, and here new word, 对方对方 So here the other side or count or counterpart. Normally, just、uh, the one work with you. So here, 对方公司 is the company you are currently working with. Okay. So the 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 translation will be the other company's material has been faxed over. Right. Perfect. Next one. 是不是对方的传真机有问题 You didn't get the material. 是不是对方的传真机有问题 ？Okay, first remember, 传真机 that's the fax machine. Okay, that's the fax machine. And this one, 对方的传真机 that's the fax machine of the other side, right? So, and this one, 是不是 is it or not? Is it or not that? The fax machine of the other party have question or here refers to problem, right? Is something wrong with other side's fax machine? Next one. 对方公司的文件传真过来了。对方公司的文件。传真过来了。Okay, same structure, but、uh, there's a new word here. First, 对方公司 recall your memory, 对方 counterpart, and the 公司 company, the other companies, blah 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 blah. 传真 faxed over already, and this is some new word. 文件 for the blah blah blah, 文件 alright that's the file or document. So here these two sentences are pretty much identical. Just I use 文件 to substitute 资料 as material, right? So 资料 material 文件 document, okay? So the document of the other company, other company's document, has been faxed over. Next one, very simple but a very useful sentence. 这个文件很重要。这个文件很重要。This and the 个 is the matter word for the document. 很 very 重要 important. Okay, so this document is very important. Make sure it's it's in good hands. Next one. 对方公司的文件发送过来了。对方公司的文件发送过来了。You probably start to get sick of this sentence. 对方公司 the company of the other side, the other company's 文件 document. Blah blah blah, 过来了 has been blah 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 the over and this is a new word 发送。发送 right to send, to send. This could be sent through email or by post. So normally here in modern times we refers to email. So the document of the other company has already been sent over. Okay. <clears throat> And next one, I actually use this a lot in daily life. 这个文件很重要，我用邮件发送给你。这个文件很重要，我用邮件发送给你。Okay, let's、uh, take a look at the first part. 这个文件很重要 
this major word, 文件 document, very important. This document is very important. I 用 to use 邮件 email. Okay, 邮件 is mail. This one 电子邮件 is email. But normally, we use 邮件 refers to email much more. Often, so normally in modern times, 邮件 we refers to email. I use email to 发送 send 给 to you. Okay, I send it to you by email. Okay, <clears throat> yeah, perfect translation. This document is very important. I send to you by email. Okay, next one. 对方公司的文件。你接到了吗 ？Sorry, this is the last time I use this structure. I promise. 对方公司的文件你接到了吗 ？Perfect. Other companies' document. You. This is a new word. 接接 here means to receive, and 到 here means to reach. As a complement of the structure, that is, we use 到 as a complement to refers to the result of the previous verb. All right, so that's the verb plus complement. So 接到 means you receive with the result. Low past tense, ma question particle. So have you already received? Oh, sorry. Have you already received the document of other company? <coughs> okay. The next one, short and useful. 你怎么不接电话？你怎么不接电话 ？Okay. You 怎么 how 不 not 接 to receive and here means to pick up, not in the list. To pick up to receive, 电话 the phone and here refers to the phone call. So 接电话 means to answer the phone, perfect, or pick up the phone call. So you how not pick up the phone? That is how come you didn't answer the phone? Right. Next one. 你说什么？我听不见。你的电话信号不好。Very good excuse to end a conversation. 你说什么？我听不见。你的电话信号不好。Okay, first, you 说 to say to talk. 什么 ？What? What did you say? 我听不见。I hear not see. All right. I 听不见。I couldn't hear you. I cannot hear. I couldn't hear you. What did you say? I couldn't hear you. 你的电话 Your phone. This is a new word. 信号。信号 Signal. Your phone signal. No good. Your phone signal is not good, right? What did you say? I can't hear you. Your phone signal is not very good. Your re uh, your receptional is not so good. Next one. 这件事情很重要，我们还是打电话说吧。这件事情很重要。我们还是打电话说吧。This, this and 件 is the major word for item. Oh, okay, major word for a piece. Okay, acceptable. 事情 for thing. So this thing or this matter, very important. Beware, we don't have to be in between. All right. This thing very important structure, subject directly. Uh, directly. Subject directly plus adjective. Okay, so this thing is very important. 
，我们无疑还是还是 still nevertheless still nevertheless we still and here just refers to or right or maybe or we should 打电话 to make a phone call to make a phone call and 说 to talk about it. But particle for suggestion at the end. Okay, so this thing is too important. Or or maybe, or or maybe just bring up another suggestion. Or we should maybe we should discuss this on the phone. Okay, and suggestion. Next one, <coughs> applied gesture. 今天太忙了。我们还是明天再说吧。今天太忙了，我们还是明天再说吧。今天 today 太 too 忙 busy today is too busy. Look here, just the particle at the end of the suggestion. Sorry, at the end of the, the, end of the sentence does not refers to past tense. 今天太忙 ，today is too busy. 我们无疑还是 or tomorrow discuss this 再 again. Okay, today is too busy. We should maybe we should maybe we should discuss this again tomorrow. Suggestion. Okay. Next one. 我的电话号码和手机号码一样。OK， 我的电话号码和手机号码一样。That's a fake sentence. The information is fake, and、uh, it is only a grammatical correct sentence, but it's not a real sentence. It means my 电话号码 phone number and 手机号码 ，All right， 手机 cell phone number。Cell phone number is 一样一样 Okay, so that means my phone number is the same with my cell phone number. Okay, so I just want to put out the difference. 电话 and the 手机电话 is a general calling for all the phones, and the 手机 is specifically refers to cell phone. Okay. And next one, interesting one. 中国的茄子和爱尔兰的茄子不一样。中国的茄子和爱尔兰的茄子不一样。Okay. First, this new word, 茄子，茄子。Eggplant, if you come from American or Albertine, okay. So, 茄子 Albertine. 中国的茄子 the Albertine in China or Chinese Albertine is not the same or just aka different. The、uh, eggplant or the Albertine in China is different from the. Ireland, Irish, Albertine. Okay, it looks different. Uh, if you're interested, you can check it online. I'm gonna keep going. Next one. 我出去走走。我出去走走。After after a very intense meeting, I. 出去 Sorry, this 出去 is a little bit shy. Just check this. 出去 to go out. Okay, 出 come out and 去 to go. So 出去 together go out. I go out and 走走走 means to walk. And 走走 just double the verb to mean the short amount of the action. I am gonna get out and for a walk. I go for a walk. I'm go out for a walk. 
Perfect. 这个文件发出去了吗？这个文件发出去了吗 ？This Measure Word document 发 is short of 发送 ，OK。Fa here is short of fa song to send. Okay, so this one fa here is short of fa song to send. Okay, here you can see fa song and fa in here. So this document sent out past tense means already. Ma question. Have this document already been sent out? Your phone and here refers to your phone call. Judged by the verb 打 to mean to make here 打电话 to make a phone call. Your phone call have you already call out or dial out the phone call? Have you already made for have you already made the phone call? Okay. Have you or sorry? Have you already made out the phone call? Next one. 马上要开会了，我们进去吧。马上要开会了，我们进去吧。马上 on the horse. Okay. On the horse means immediately. Immediately, ya is going to here, not in here. Ya here means immediately is going to 开会 have the meeting. La here at the end part go to indicate the change. 我们进去吧吧 suggestion and this is new word 进去 Okay, they're a little bit both bit too shy to come out and go inside. Okay. 进去，进去 ，OK。This one 进去 to mean go inside or get inside, OK。So the meeting is the the meeting is about to start soon. We should go inside, OK。Next one， 会议的资料放进去了吗？会议的资料放进去了吗？ This sentence sounds like、uh, the boss is talking to the secretary, holding a folder of the meeting. Okay, just before the meeting starts, 会议的会议 remember meeting the 会 meetings 资料 material the material of the meeting. Have you already put inside? Okay, have you already? Have you already put inside the material of the meeting? Okay. Next one. 你按我说的做。你按我说的做。This one is our new word. 按。按。The original meaning of 按 is to press. No, sorry. The most common meaning for now is to press. And normally, and here it means you press me. No, that makes no sense.、It、means you do. 我说的 And here is it's eliminated the part something I said. Alright, so you do what I said. And here and press indicate. Follow the route exactly, or so it means according to you. Do according to what I said. You do as I say. Okay. Or the original meaning appear in the text. 按一下这个键。按一下这个键。Okay. An means to press, and 一下 just to indicate one time for the action. So 按一下 just just to press, just to press this, 这 this 个 measure word, and this one 键键 
is another new word for today that's the button or key okay the button or key so 按一下这个键 means just to press this button okay next one 我们要说一个事情 你先出去一下吧 我们要说一个事情 你先出去一下吧 OK 我们 We 要 is about to 说 To talk To discuss 一个 One 个 measure word 事情 Matter We're about to discuss matter We're about to we want to say a thing, okay. We're about to talk about a thing. You to get out. Just go out, get out. Isha, one time of the action, but suggestion. And this is our new word. Xian. Xian, that means first and firstly, first. So we're about we're about to discuss a thing or matter. You first go out. So we're about to discuss something. Would you mind to go out first to ask something for leave? Next one. 这是中国的号码。你得先按零零八六。这是中国的号码。你得先按零零八六。Wow, well, cool advance. This is Hauma number. Remember this new word Hauma for number. Hauma. This is a Chinese number. It refers to the phone number. Ni Dei. Dei. Alright. When this one pronounced Dei. A certain day that means have to, okay? When this one pronounces as day, it means have to. So you have to, perfect, the translation is perfect. You have to press or just put down 0086 first. Okay? So Whenever you call a Chinese cell phone, you need to add Ling Ling Ba Liu in front of the cell phone number. Just like you use 353 here to make an international call for Irish phones. Okay, next one. 我们说完了,你进去吧。我们说完了,你进去吧。that sounds like a sentence expression after this sensitive matter have already been discussed and you come out from the meeting room and you talk to your Chinese staff. We talked one, one finished. We finished our talking. We talk and hear complete finished. So the structure is, I use shu as the verb and one as the complement for the results of the verb shu. So we've already finished, we've finished our talking. You go inside, please. We've already finished our talk, you could go inside now. Next one. 按完零零八六以后,再按电话号码。按完零零八六以后,再按电话号码 OK You press finish 007以后 after So that means after you pressed or just typed down 0086 on your cell phone Again, press 电话号码, the phone number Okay, so it means you you press you press the cell phone number again after you press Lingling Balio first. Okay. 
Next one. 你说什么？我听不见。你的电话信号不好。Sorry, I think we have it. We really have this sentence. Oh, apologize. Last one. 最后我们还是分手了。Sorry. Okay. Here. 最后我们还是分手了 Okay, a very sad sentence. 最后我们还是分手了 Okay, 还是 Remember, it can mean or or still. And here, this one refers to still. 我们 us still. 分手 farewell. Oh, that's a very gentle translation. That means broke up. Okay, so 分手 break up. 分 means depart. Separate, great. Separate, and show your hand. Your hand, your two hand hold together. When you are in love, separate it. Break up. We. Still, break up. La indicated change, and the change is the go the broke of the relationship here. This is our new word. 最后 last or at last. So finally, we break up. Oh shoot! That changed the tone of the sentence completely. 最后 in the end, we still broke up. Okay, that sounds. From a person who valued the previous relationship very much, and probably not the one who bring up about the broke up, and finally we broke up. That sounds like a guy who's de- desperate, want to get out from this relationship. All right, that's difference. This one, 最后 at last, and at last, 最后 let's. See the last sentence. 会议的最后，我们说一下这个事情。会议的最后，我们说一下这个事情。会议的最后 ，meetings end. So at the end of the meeting, all right, not the last meeting. At the end of the meeting. Of the meeting, we short to talk a little bit about 这个 this major word 事情 matter matter. So at the end of the meeting, let's discuss a little bit about this thing. Okay, that's all the sentences. Let let me repeat them from the beginning. 这是我的电话号码。会议室的房间号码是多少？这是我的传真号码。资料传真过来了。我们的传真机坏了。对方公司的资料传真过来了。是不是对方的传真机有问题？对方公司的文件传真过来了。这个文件很重要。对方公司的文件发送过来了。这个文件很重要。我用邮件发送给你。对方公司的文件你接到了吗？你怎么不接电话？你说什么？我听不见。你的电话信号不好。这件事情很重要，我们还是打电话说吧。今天太忙了，我们还是明天再说吧。我的电话号码和手机号码一样
，中国的茄子和爱尔兰的茄子不一样。我出去走走。这个文件发出去了吗？你的电话打出去了吗？马上要开会了，我们进去吧。会议的资料放进去了吗？你按我说的做，按一下这个键。我们要说一个事情。你先出去一下吧。这是中国的号码，你得先按0086。我们说完了，你进去吧。按完0086以后，再按电话号码。最后，我们还是分手了。会议的最后。我们说一下这个事情。Okay, that's all. Thanks for your attention.